shake that body. Hello and welcome to ADSR Pro with me, Mike Smith. Uh, I'm just going to show you how to use your external virus TI as an effects processor um, within Cubase, obviously. Uh, so let's get started. Uh, basically, I've just got a couple of loops in here, and what I'm going to do is open up a virus TI. So this will just take a minute just to open up. Uh, what we're going to do is process the drum loop and I've got some vocals there as well um, Obviously, this is really really powerful So first thing we need to do in Cubase is click on patch utility And we're just going to leave this as it is. We're not going to do anything else Simple as and then go to the effects section and now what we need to do is tell the virus where to look for audio um, And we're going to select static input is left and right now I've obviously run um, analog three and four of my sound card into the virus, so you would need to wire up, depending on your sound card, um, some outputs into the virus. Uh, in my case, like I said, I've got three and four. So if I open up the mixer, you can see here there's analog one and two, which is going to the uh, Camtasia software that I'm recording this video with, and three and four is patched into my virus i've already named this virus out so all we need to do now is click on our drum loop and instead of it going to stereo out we'll select the virus outs so and if we just play that drum loop back so there you go nice and clean just going to so if i go to the filter section i'm moving the filter on the virus Put that one to a so there's the filters. If we go to effects, uh, let's go to effects two first and we'll put a um, bit of reverb on so there you can hear the reverb. Bring it back a little bit, maybe try a bit of delay. to put loads on there so you can hear it turn that off effects one let's have a bit of chorus there you go a bit of phaser maybe a bit of distortion So as you can hear, really, really powerful. So let's mute the drums now. Let's do the same with the vocals. Currently going to no bus. Let's select our virus out. And in theory, just bear with me. I've muted something, I think. On the stars. There we go. I close my eyes and my hand we drift away to a place beyond the stars. I close my eyes and my hand we drift away to a place beyond the stars. I close my Beyond the stars, I close my eyes and my hand. 
So there you can go. Um, you can hear there, really, really powerful. Uh, the virus has got some amazing effects in it. And obviously with being so powerful as well, you can apply all sorts of different things. Uh, I currently don't have a analog audio out of my virus into the computer because you could obviously record those effects straight back in. Uh, I'm not sure how you do it with USB recording the audio back in. It's probably something I'll look into. Uh, I just really quickly did this tutorial because somebody was asking on the Cubase forum uh, about how you get your virus TI uh, within Cubase to um, use as an effects processor if you like. So that's it, just a quick tutorial of course, please do subscribe to my channel. Uh, if you've got any questions then get in touch and of course, uh, yeah, until next time, take care, bye bye. Check that body. Get, get, get.